Hi, my name is Casey. I'm a software engineer with Google, and I'm here today to tell you about visual search and Google goggles. So visual search is for those moments when you can't quite put what you want to search for into words. A great example of this is with artwork. When you're looking at a painting you don't know the name of, it's really hard to come up with the right search terms. But with Google goggles, you can take a picture and then use that picture as your query. So for example, let's try with this picture I have. So Goggles came back and it told us it's Vincent van Gogh's Starry Night. Now, an even more magical thing that Google Goggles can do is with landmarks. So say you're on a trip and you see this building you don't recognize. You can use Google Goggles and take a picture of that building and it should come back with information about it. Let's try it out on this photo I took during one of my vacations. This time, Google Goggles came back with Beijing National Stadium. That's pretty cool. Even more amazing is Goggles' translate feature. What it can do is take a picture and then translate whatever text is in that picture into whatever language you want. Let's try it out on this German menu I have. I'm gonna use the crop button here in the corner. It helps us take a more accurate photo. And there you have it. Goggles has recognized there's text in the photo extracted it, and translated it into English for us. Spring salad with wild herbs wrapped in Parmesan cheese and bacon. Sounds delicious. When you can take a picture of something and it comes back just like that and tells you all this information, it's really exciting. And it's only going to get better if you know, more and more people use it and we work together to make it a better product.